everybody, this is Shannon from the Heatstead. Just wanted to do a quick video to show you how we try to control the squash bugs that we have attacking our zucchini plants. The last two years we haven't got much of the crop at all and I've done tons of research on squash bugs and it seems like everybody has just as bad a problem as we do about trying to eliminate them. Even people that use pesticides, which is something we try not to do, um, they don't even save the squash bugs because they have such a hard outer shell that the pesticide doesn't even get to um, their softer parts and to kill them. Um, and there's people like me last year, I used diatomaceous earth and it's supposed to um, microscopically scratch up their abdomen and kill them by drying them out. We tried that last year and it did not work either. And so most people that I've read on the internet, they just have to go along and remove them by hand, put them into a container of soapy water. So I've got an old container um, that we had mixed nuts in and I just added some hot water and some Dawn dish soap to it. And I've been picking them off and just throwing them in here. Um, I'll go through and do some other plants so you can see, but even the pieces I find on the bottom of the leaves, on the bottom of the leaves, they tend to like to lay eggs in um, a V of a veining system, and that's what they've done on this one. This is the bottom side of the leaf, and they've gone through, and there's the V in the um, plant's leaf, and they lay these orangish um, brown colored eggs. And so last year, I just scraped them off, and we still lost all of our zucchini plants. So this year, I'm cutting the sections off, and I'm putting them here in the soapy water as well. Um, these are a couple of adults that I found. Um, and I squashed these ones but because um, I didn't have my soapy water yet. But I went back in, got the soapy water, and I put all the squashed ones that I even did into the soapy water. And I've done one plant and I found all of this already. Several leaves with eggs on it and about six or eight adults just on this one plant. And I have eight more down the line. So I'm going to continue to work my way down my row of zucchini and see if we can't find some more. I don't know if they bite or pinch, so I pick up the live ones with a gloved hand. I've already gone ahead on this one, and I did find a couple of, see there's a live one right there, and they do pinch because I can actually feel that through the glove, but I'm just going to throw them in the soapy water, and the soapy water coats them, and they can't get out of it, and so it will eventually kill them. I'll leave this out here with a lid. That way, every time that I come out, I can just go along, check my plants, and throw the squash bugs into the soapy water. And as you can see, he's already stopped moving. So it works pretty quickly. It's very organic, just Dawn dish soap and a little bit of hot water. And um, it is time consuming because <laughs> I have to go down every plant. They tend to like the leaves that are um, closer to the ground because obviously it's gonna be cooler down there, but they lay their eggs on there. And this one has a little cluster of eggs. So I'm just taking a knife and cutting that section of the leaves out and I'm throwing those in the soapy water too. So I'm gonna go ahead and continue on down the line and pick off all the adults and cut off all the egg clusters that I find. And I'll do this every day just to try to get this under control because I really don't want to lose my zucchini plants this year. But I figured I'd do a quick video to let other people know this is how we control the squash bugs that have prolifically attacked our zucchini for the last couple years. Hopefully it's been helpful for you. Thank you, bye.